What is up guys? In this video, we are playing Hogwarts Legacy for the very first time ever. So, just picked this up today for the pre-order. It's a couple days early and I'm super excited. This is going to be such a great game to delve right into. So let's just dive right in. And the first thing that we get is a couple of settings. So I can select all this different stuff, menu readers, uh, reads text buttons and other elements. We're going to like go in depth with all this stuff because I feel like we should because, you know, first time ever playing this. So you can go left handed if you are left handed. That's kind of cool. Uh, can we dead soon? I don't know. This all seems fine. Apparently, like the controls are a bit interesting so we can focus on fidelity or performance so high fidelity is rendering modes favored for resolution and graphical quality or performance which is high frame rates favoring performance so we're going to go with performance mode today with high frame rates because i'm using an elgato capture card anyway so it's not like we're going to get anything more with high fidelity mode if that makes sense all right, so I can claim my rewards. Right, so if I connect to WD Games, we can get that maybe another time. I just want to get straight to the gameplay. <laughs> just get stuck in. I don't want to like waste too, like, too much time. I just want to have some fun. Okay, so we can affect the brightness and stuff like that. Uh, it seems fine. Yeah, seems okay. We are pleased to inform you that we have accepted have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Ooh, that's exciting. And I gotta select all the characters. So let's have a look at all these characters because why not? Character creation is one of the funnest things. So you can select all these people. I saw that one in the advert, which is quite cool. We've got this guy here. We've got a lot of characters here. They look very like lifelike in a way. It's very, very cool. And you can sort of, you know, scroll out the different characters. I'm loving the outfit that we have. Nice. Who would I go for? I'm definitely thinking like this character right here kind of looks a little bit like me, I guess. It's the closest to me. So we're going to go for that. And then. We can go for like different shaped noses and stuff. Character creation is like always so much fun. Yeah, he's kind of cool. He's like me. Ooh, I can get some glasses like Harry Potter. Okay, yeah, I love the glasses. Why not? And you can select like all these different hairstyles. I could have like a woman's hairstyle if I really wanted a woman's hairstyle, which is quite fun. We can do like something like this. <laughs> That's quite fun. There's a lot of different stuff. Can go very, very long. Ooh, dreadlocks. Ooh, I like the way they move. That's quite fun. Oh, it looks like Legolas. That is quite fun. Let's go for like... I don't know, I just want something nice. Oh, that's kind of nice. I love the sense of detail right here. Yeah, that's fun. Mmm, do I want to go longer? Ooh, nice. Yep, definitely uh, very current with the hairstyle of that one. Complexion. So we change the complexion of the character. Okay, is that just of the, what, of the nose mainly? Okay, I see, I see. So it goes a bit darker, I guess. More freckles. Ah, nice, 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 nice. So got different stuff here with the freckles. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep like sort of minimal with that sort of stuff. I don't know. You can have like scars and stuff. That's kind of cool. I don't know. I, li I like it as it is. Looks cool. Nice. Is he? No, no. I thought he had like a dodgy eye for a second. He's fine. The eye color we could change. Whoa, these are crazy. Yeah, nice. I like blue eyes. Nice. Now we can change the eyebrow color. That's funny. Haha. <laughs> you could have, like, really cool eyebrows. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. I like that. No, no, no. We don't want to, like, too blonde. 
That's fun. Nice. We go like really angry. <laughs> Have like no eyebrows. Kind of ha unibrow. Ah, six to that one. Oh mate, voice one or voice two. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Ah, uh, yeah, voice one. That was quite something. What if we? It was wonderful. What's the highest pitch? A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Mm. That was quite something. Let's go really low. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Yeah, let's go normal difficulty. Like people say, ah, oh, shouldn't go too easy, so we can go normal. All right, let's go. Gary. Gary Potter, let's go. Let's go. Because my first name is... Hang on, that's not right. Gary Potter, because my first name is um, Gary, so... We'll go with that one. All right, there he is, Gary Potter. <laughs> Come on, Gary. Oh, this is cool. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. I love it so much already. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force a to be with wand. when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Oh, <laughs> Eliasar, George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not. I've heard there's no like backstory I'm behind this. It's just straight into it. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try, <laughs> gave quite the fright to some theatre goers in the West End. <laughs> It's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must yeah. say I best not speak here, Eliazar. What a name. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We had a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Are they going straight to Hogwarts? It's invisible! Ooh! Flies! They're in London, I can tell, in like... Some like... Some past tense. 1800 sort of vibes, I would say. Ooh! Warner Brothers games! Super epic. Avalanche. This is an avalanche. Wow. The music just like drives you in. Oh my gosh. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> There's magic, man. <laughs> Gives you that feeling that you used to have when you used to watch this companion? as a kid. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Mm. That's what I was thinking. I? Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues Ooh. at the Ministry, I believe he is a Dragon? significant 
threat. And it That's was so your good. wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Ooh. It's a key. How it's a poor key. We do. Whoa. Run. That's crazy. What is going on? Oh, they're gonna grab it and then like they're gonna transfer it somewhere else. Oh, that was so close! Oh my god! Are you all right? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Let's heal up a little bit. Nice. What happened? Gary Paul oh, George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. I'm so intrigued right now, man. Oh, what? Oh, my God. London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. You the port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path However faded it may be. Good luck. Try not to die. Oh, that's quick. Mind your step. All right. So there's like this icon on top of the character Where to follow them. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. 
a powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. The world building of this is crazy, Hogwarts bro. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. This is random mountain in the middle of nowhere. Possession of the port key. But I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, there's the path down below. This Whoa. way. That's about to fall off the edge. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizard. I feel like world. I lost my legs just then. <laughs> But magic is no different than any power. What happens if I press triangle? What really matters is the one oh, who we I know how to dodge roll now. Circle. What is in there? Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on yeah, the right. center. Okay. Tap R2. I'm pressing R2. There we go. Nice. Whoa. <laughs> Excellent. Ah, that's cool. Oh, what's in there? How do we break this? Can I just like break it? Ah, oh, that's cool. Oh, falling over. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Oh, that's sick. Loving this. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Pew. Ah, up there. Let's go. <laughs> it's so much fun to actually do this. <gasps> oh, chest! Chest, let's have a look. Did I get anything? I don't know if I actually got anything or not. Right, so this is the main menu. Cool. Pew. Pew pew. We're it's like a light side man. It's just ahead. It's super windy, man. Steady yourself. Making a bridge. That is crazy cool. Almost there. Getting there. So much fun. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Yeah, that's looking shiny. I gotta go up this way. Huh. Professor, it's a mule it's of some mule. kind. Mm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Huh. Well, how am I supposed to get up this way?
Professor, this statue... This may have been his home! Oh, yeah. Ah, you can go around the back way. Let's go. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! Whoa. This looks scary. How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. Like the glow it's on the It's like the snake again. voice. Sayas, Sayas. What in Merlin's name? Wake the goblin. Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. What the heck is going on? <laughs> Hello? Aren't goblins usually, like, really angry in these games? Uh, just a moment. <laughs> uh -huh. <clears throat> it's always the music that, like, changes the dynamic of anything. <laughs> the way they're looking at each other is like, uh, what's going on? Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. <clears throat> Vault number 12, I presume. Precisely. Vault number 12. Let's go. Straight to it. Oh, this is sick! How many vaults are there? Hundreds. In oh fact, you'll see quite my a way to vault number 12. God. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? I love this so much. They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both. Could have arranged for such a service. It's like a roller coaster. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries oh, ago. It resides God. in the deepest part of the bank. The deepest part? So uh. quite a distance to go. Oh my gosh, this is like... Amazing. So much nostalgia. Vault number... Vault 12! Momentous day! <laughs> hmm. On your way. That's what I mean, like, they're heaps grumpy, so I'm surprised that one of them's, like, really nice. There's no in between with them. They're either really nice or really not. That is so interesting. Professor, hmm? the armband that God was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw in the porky container. No, darker. Mm. I saw that same glow in the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Huh. <laughs> Here we are. They always get like the most unusual stuff. <laughs> when was the last time this fort was accessed? That's a great question. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. 
In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Huh. Yeah, until today. That's exciting. And the world building here is just unreal. Thank you for your help. It's there. <gasps> Just... Oh, we got 36 coins. Oh, man. I'm just obsessed with like, the world building more than anything. I can't wait to like explore this world and just see like everything in it. What do you think you should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir? I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Oh! Best of luck. <laughs> that was stuck in... That was certainly There has to be another poor key or something like that. Let Maybe a dragon. Think. Who knows? There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio. Is that guy yes, the a revealing charm? No time. He's like the, the one present. who does the wands Let's see and what stuff. We're missing, I feel. We? Ready your wand and focus. Right, so I gotta Oh what? Oh so I gotta press down. Nice. Nice. Rebellion. There, uh, I saw something. That's cool. Move a bit closer and try again. Interesting. A door. It's a door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. I'm really enjoying this Lead game the right way. now. Okay. Let's go. Is there another blue mask? Okay. Bro. This is no ordinary vault. It's just like one thing after the other, after the other, after the other. After the other. It's crazy. Oh, this is some sort of test. I do. Revelli. What end I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. This is wild. Yeah, let's run. Let's go. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Oh, it's like the souls of Sauron. Rebellion. Okay, what do we do? Like, step on it? What what is going on? When I moved towards There's the no glow, context. It suddenly <laughs> seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir, I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. Yeah. That statue. What statue? He can I see, see things sort of that no one else can only see. A reflection in the floor. It's wild. How do I proceed? What is going on? There must be something to that reflection you're seeing. Rebellion. I presume this is what you oh. reflected in the floor. There you go. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Yeah, let's cast Lumos.
So this is how you unlock spells. Right, so hold R2 and tap Lumos. Well done. Wild. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Yeah, you gotta like match it. I don't know whether to be scared or like excited right now. Take him. Whoa. So many spells. What, what am I supposed to do? Right, right, so. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, I see. Nice. Oh, what the heck? Nice. Stay close. All right, I'm staying close, man. <laughs> what is going on? Professor. Professor Fig. Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Lumos. Where am I supposed to go? Yeah, I don't know, bro. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Okay. Well, we got another chest, which is good. There we go, found it. Ah, that's where they're leading me. A glowing Again? Rebellion. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Oh, here we go. Okay. Right, okay. Lumos. Let's go. There's a few like puzzle type stuff in here as well. Boom. Number three. Is that it? Perhaps I need to get them all to stand at once. How? Ah, there we go. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Right, so I need to... Ah, I'm trying! Okay, I gotta go this way then. This nice, we did well. Take 
Right, so you gotta like stun him. Ooh. Yeah, hold it. Nice. Go. Get it. Doing well. Yeah, buddy. Nice. We're doing it. Come on. I'm pressing like R2 and stuff. Oof. Nice. Good job. Whew. Revelio. Lumos. Oh man. Oh, we gotta go that way then. Yep. Oh, nice. What is this thing? Again. Oh, that's better. I don't want to face those things anymore, man. Oh, creepy. Let's go. Oh, man. I remember these things. These things are like memory things. That's what Dumbledore used to use for like the memories. Uh, there you are. <laughs> How did you? Who knows? <laughs> what is this, this place? I'm confused too. Know. What is this place? <laughs> I found this floating above that basin. I've no idea what's that going on. That is not a basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. Huh? I wonder. I'm wondering too. What's going on? Follow my lead. Follow my lead. Okay, Ed Sheeran. Most like it's Albus Dumbledore. Oh no, these guys look like they would be from like the what Ministry of Magic or something the like that. Is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one well, of impossible see of ancient magic as I can. So our main the character can see traces of ancient magic. Personal. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Interesting. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. With great... We've done all that we can. Magic comes great responsibility. There's a bit of lag in there. Oh, he's putting his memories in. Okay. So there's a, 
a little bit of backstory. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Bit of explanation there. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, yeah. to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed. Who can never see could it? Never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. Mm. We were all look rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? Yeah, why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Looks evil. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that... The instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. Oh no. That's scary. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well. Perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Whoa. He's powerful. What is going on? Oh, dude. I don't know what's going on at all, but it's awesome. You must be the protector or something like that. <gasps> Go! Don't die. That was so close. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It can't be, can it? It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Are we going to Hogwarts? Come. We have Bruh. a sorting ceremony to get to. Oh my gosh. Please, I want to find out where I'm going. Is this like the dodgy forest? It is. Oh my god. Ah! I'm so sad. I'm like, oh my god. Dude. I love it. I've never been so excited for a game in my entire life. 
and I need to wait for the game content installation to complete. But on that note, alright, fine. I'll see you guys in the next episode. But that was such an epic intro. Wow. <laughs>